Good evening, everybody. Welcome back to the channel, everyone. Uh, hope everybody's staying safe out there amidst this new normal in our society. Hope uh, your families are doing well. Hope your loved ones are well. Uh, if any of them are sick or under the weather or have contracted uh, what's going on, I hope that they seek uh, the medical attention they need and I hope that they get well and I hope that they are able to remain here on uh, God's green earth with the rest of us. So, without any further ado, y'all, I bought up uh, strawberry mini donuts from Little Debbie. I apologize in advance our front facing camera is not the greatest and uh but anyway i wanted to bring this review to you. these are two bags for four dollars today at the grocery store when i went shopping uh i picked up a whole bunch of new products for the channel also for reviews and uh so let's tear these open i didn't do a very good job of it but i'll try to do the best i can let's take a small test there right Mmm, I get a strawberry and I get a glazed donut. I'm getting both of those smells in one shot here with these. At $2 a bag, it is a 9.68 ounce package. It says about four and a half servings per container at four donuts per serving for a total of 280 calories. Okay, so let's take a couple out of here and see what we're working with, everyone. I really enjoy bringing all these little goodies uh, to the channel and reviewing them. I mean, not only do I enjoy reviewing them for you, the people, and the viewers, but I also enjoy getting my fix of a sweets. <laughs> I have a really bad sweet tooth, in case a lot of y'all haven't noticed. Uh, yeah, you he does. Check out our chocolate candy playlist. You can ch check out our snacks, uh, snack bars, and other. So let's break a donut in half, everybody. Here, see what's going on inside. And there you have it. Look at there. It's a strawberry inside, and it's got what appears to be a white glaze. Look, they're glazed for me, donuts. So let's try one. Here we go. By the way, I had these in the fridge so they're cold, so they don't melt in my fingers with the glaze. But they're already starting to. Yeah, mm. it's been hot up in here. There's a heat wave moving over the central Midwest uh, here over the next 12 hours. We're going to go from ideal weather of 74 degrees with a cool breeze to... Uh, temps up in the upper 80s, lower 90s, with heat indexes over 100. So, the next video is going to be unbearable, my peeps. But anyway, back to the review at hand here. Let's try the other half of this. Mm. Okay. Well, so far, my taste buds have discerned. Strawberry with a nice glazed coating. It's a very delightful flavor. The texture is right on the money. Um, it seems to be a pretty good quality. The filling is very much resemblant that of the chocolate with the yellow uh, filling on the inside, even though this is strawberry is the same texture, same material, just different flavor and coloring. Um, they're good little donuts, y'all. I like them plenty. So on a one to five scale, let's give these bad boys a rating. How did you do tonight, little Debbie? I don't know, Ron. Let's see. Just tell me what you think of my delightful goodness. It's inside every bag. Okay. I will do that, little Miss Debbie. All right, Miss <laughs> Debbie. There it is. And uh, please don't uh, lock me out of your kitchen of delectable delights in the future. For my review and my reading, here we go. Three, two, one. Kabam! Straight on four. Four, 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 four. Um, 
everything about the product delivery, the flavor, the representation, the packaging, the price point range was all within a fair market value. Would I buy these again? I'm pretty sure I would, seeing as how I've already reviewed the Hostess uh, version, and it was quite a disappointment, as where this one was actually delightful. Uh, I don't think I've ever really had a bad product from Low Debbie. Uh, I've been a, a consumer of their products for a good many years, and they do have good quality. And I'm guessing that they have a pretty good work uh, crew within their manufacturing facility. Uh, I'll see if I can find out where they manufacture these right quick for y'all. It says lowdebbie.com. Okay, they're made in, it says McKee Foods, College Dale, Tennessee. Okay, y'all, so from down south. And a lot of good food comes from the down south. So there you have it, everybody. I hope you enjoyed this video with me. I really enjoyed spending this time with you all. I'm glad you come by the channel and visit. Uh, if you're not already a subscriber, please consider subscribing to the channel uh, and turn on that post notification bell. We welcome all new subscribers. And I do check in our creator studio to see who all has subscribed to the channel. And uh, channels that have 10 or more legitimate subscribers and have legitimate contact, I will watch your video and I will contemplate, if not flat out, just subscribe to your channel. But, however, on the flip side of that coin, if you have just created a profile on YouTube just so that you can uh, watch videos and leave comments and all that kind of stuff, but you have no uh, vis visible content upon your channel. If it's just created for the sole purpose of interacting, chances are I probably won't uh, subscribe you. But I will support you, and if you do ever become a full-time creator, we will be there first and foremost. I guarantee you, I give you my word. I reply to all comments typically within 30 days or less. So with that being said, I'm going to get out here, y'all. And once again, go out and give these a try. We found these at Fairway Grocery Stores in Clear Lake, North Iowa. And it was definitely worth it. So thanks again, everybody. I hope you're enjoying the new uh, uh, routine we're using here at the channel. And I look forward in the future to interacting with each and every one of you. And from uh, our home to your home, God bless. May he keep you safe. And uh, what else? May he keep you healthy. Until then, everybody, I'm out of here. Have a great rest of your day. And we'll catch you all in the next video. Bye-bye, everybody.